Just last week, Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha warned that the state will not tolerate individuals opposed to the new education curriculum. What the hell do you want and who the hell do you think you are to be saying that nothing is going on? None of us is Jesus Christ for heaven's sake. And I want to assure the country with all humility that this is the right thing to do. As expected, the teacher's umbrella union, Nat, did not take these sentiments lightly. In his characteristic nature, outspoken Nat Secretary General Wilson Socion responded, charging that teachers will not be intimidated by threats from the Ministry of Education and the teacher's employer, TSC. Socion warned the education minister to brace for a tough battle ahead. If Magoha and group insist on going on, we shall pile more pressure. Even if it means calling you out on strike. The NAT boss says lack of consultations over implementation of the CBC has pushed teachers to a wall and may have no other option but down tools. Maybe Monday we will ask you so that on Wednesday you don't go to school to teach, you walk to the county director's office and tell them that CBC is dead if they don't believe. The union wondered why the ministry is pushing for implementation of a curriculum which appears headed for failure. He insists that till death, the reasons behind shifting to a new education structure have not been laid bare and why there was no parliamentary input in the matter. Number one, summative evolution of 844 was not done so that we can be told whether it's a bad system or it's relevant. Number two, needs assessment was poorly done by KICD. When Sushan makes a pronouncement, he's speaking on behalf of all the teachers. I hate it when the authorities that be want to vilify him and call him names. But I want to tell them today, the Kenyan teachers are strongly, squarely, firmly behind Mweshmiwa Wilson Sushan over this the CBC clash has seen the teachers' union now advocate for the appointment of cabinet secretaries from elected members of parliament, citing lack of consultation by the current crop of ministers. The push and pull now a subject of concern from leaders who are calling for a ceasefire between the union and the Ministry of Education. There is just one little ingredient that you need to omit from your curriculum, and that is arrogance. You must ensure that this curriculum is not about the personality of Magoha and the personality of Sosio. Come Chemenzam, Channel 1 News.